Hi, my name is Alicia and welcome to my channel. Today I read this book, The 100 Dresses by Eleanor Estes. It won the Newbery Honor and it was written in 1994. Um, it's quite a long ago. Um, also, it has many illustration, so it's kind of picture book like this. So I want to talk about it, but I will talk about it later. I am talking about the story now, but before it, I should talk about something to you. Um, as I said before, this book was short, so the story of this book was shorter than the other book that I reviewed. Um, I will not say all the story, but it might have some spoiler. Please excuse me. Okay, there was a girl whose name was Wanda Petrovsky. Her name was a little bit strange, so some children laughed at her. Not just because of it. Um, she was bullied since she didn't speak well. Um, she was too forgettable, so when she was absent, no one uh, noticed it. It was Maddie and Peggy that bully Wanda most. They did the game to tease her. It was dress game. It starts that the, someone in room 13, which was the Wanda's class, wore her new dress. Everyone talked about their dresses or shoes. And that time, Wanda said she had a hundred dresses all lined up in her clothes and 60 pairs of shoes too. However, Wanda always wore her faded blue dresses so everyone didn't believe her but they acted as if they really had believed her. One day, there was a dress design contest in room 13. Maddie and other children thought that Peggy must be the winner of the contest as she drew the pictures very well. But the winner was Wanda, not Peggy. Wanda drew a hundred different dresses and all of them were great and beautiful. Children, including Maddie and Peggy, were surprised at her, so they decided to find her. There were more story after that, so I hope you read it yourself. This book described children bullying with beautiful illustrations and mood. Uh, actually, it is the not special topic, but the atmosphere was special. I think the illustration played a role for it. I will show some to you like this. And it was my favorite pictures and it shows Wanda's 100 dresses. And I think a uh, distorted picture using primary color goes really well with this book. Also, this book won the Newbery Award. Honestly, I haven't read the many book which won the Newbery, but uh, I read a few. For example, the Night Diary, Charlotte's Web, The Girl Who Drank the Moon, and Last Dub in the Market Street. And all of them were calm. Also, it was written in 1994. So it was like classic. 
but I generally don't like classic while my brother likes it. So I was afraid of it first, but it was great. It was not really old and it was relaxing. My book review is end. If you are interested in this book, try it. Thank you for watching my video and goodbye. There were more stories after that. So please, no, please, no, please, no, please, no, please. <laughs>